Theme eight, keeping oneself clean, safe, and healthy. Chapter ten, safety rules. Staying away from danger is called safety. There are many ways in which we can be harmed if we are not careful. It is important to live safely and follow safety rules. We should follow safety rules at home, at school, and on the road. Safety at home. Do not play with things like scissors, knife, blade, switches and wires, medicines, matchsticks. Do not touch the following things with wet hands. An iron, an oven, a geyser, a toaster. Do not touch electrical sockets and switches. With wet hands, you may get an electric shock. Do not leave your toys, bags and shoes on the floor. You or someone else could fall over them. Do not go near stoves. Do not touch hot pans or boiling water. Do not open the door for a stranger. Do not touch hot pans. Think and answer. Skills, expressions and explanation. Why should you not touch electrical switches with wet hands? Safety in school. Do not push others on the stairs or while boarding the school bus. Always walk in a queue. Do not leave school or go anywhere with a stranger. Always throw waste into a dustbin. We should walk in a queue. Safety on the road. Never walk alone on the road. Always walk with a grown up. Do not play or run on the road. Never stick out your hand or any other body parts when traveling in a moving car or bus always cross the road at a zebra crossing with a grown up we should not play on the road we should walk in a queue we should cross the road with a grown-up. Safety on the playground. Wait for your turn on the swings. Do not stand in front of a moving swing. Do not push others on the slides. Always stand behind a moving swing. First aid. 
even if we follow safety rules we may get hurt at times it is very important to help when someone gets hurt the help given to an injured person before a doctor arrives is known as first aid two important rules that should always be followed are never crowd around a person who is hurt call an elder or a doctor immediately it is important to know how to give first aid to people whenever needed let us learn some common first aid rules skills discussion and explanation discuss why should we not crowd around someone who is hurt the wound should be cleaned with water first in case of cuts and wounds clean the wound with clean water first then use an antiseptic lotion over the cut or the wound and call an adult in case of burns putting ice cubes and cold water helps you can even put an antiseptic ointment after that in case of a fall you can put ice cubes on the area that is hurt till help arrives it is important to keep a first aid box ready at school as well as at home if a person needs to be taken to a hospital then ask a grown up to dial 102 and call an ambulance this is a first aid box crepe bandage antiseptic lotion bandage cotton and scissors green points skill concerned for justice and equality waste should be thrown only in a dustbin and not on the road as people can fall on them and hurt themselves what will you do if you see banana peel on the floor in your classroom did you know turmeric haldi is an antiseptic and can be used to treat cuts and wounds good and bad touch a good touch makes us feel happy safe and comfortable we feel good when we get a pat on our back from our teachers or are hugged by our family members however sometimes when a person touches you it makes you uncomfortable this is a bad touch if someone's 
टच मेक्स यू फील बैड रन अवे एट वंस डू नॉट गो नियर दैट पर्सन टेल योर पेरेंट्स और एल्डर्स अबाउट इट वैल्यूज एंड लाइफ स्किल्स we should help each other in times of need we should always give first aid to people when they are hurt have you ever helped somebody who was hurt children this is the flow chart of our safety points to remember our safety live safely and follow safety rules follow different safety rules at different places home avoid playing with unsafe things school follow safety rules road use zebra crossing to cross the road playground wait for your turn on the swings give first aid to a person who is hurt before help arrives keep first aid box ready in schools as well as at home words to learn safety means the state of being safe boarding means getting on a bus train ship or aeroplane first aid means immediate and simple medical help given to an injured person before you can take him or her to a hospital antiseptic something that stops germs from growing and causing an infection ointment means a smooth cream that can be rubbed on the skin to heal a wound